day and all night would stay up it felt so right we were so young we were so dumb we would get drunk and then hook up we were okay we were all right staying awake till the sunrise we were in love couldn't stop us like a good drug yeah. never run we hook up in my car driving so far playing your guitar you'd show me your wrong let down our guards think with our hearts stare at the stars we were never apart drinking too young way too much fun out in the sun open when it's gone took you to prom dance to our song dance all night long till the lights come on Now I remember everything And how careless we could be And how careless we could be That is so fast. How is it hanging, peeps? And welcome back to another episode of Plankcraft. Um, as you guys noticed in the clips, we went to the end and we got a lot of shulker boxes. Look at that. Can I open the chest? There you go. Full chest of shulker boxes and a few. I've even already used nine at our nether tunnel hub or our nether tunnel. Uh, I filled it up with netherrack completely so that it's easier to move and just so that I have a little bit more storage. And uh, I was working on this project too. <laughs> so many projects. Uh, you guys saw this. And we've actually been here before too. Uh, this we worked on pretty recently. This was from last week I think. But after that... I did all of this. I even put down a few signs, like there's going to be a massive coral reef over here. Uh, the bone tail, I've got a head on the other side of something. I don't know what it is, but it's it's a head. So I was thinking maybe the tail on the other side of the hill would be cool. Uh, oh yeah, we had some, uh, <laughs> some spawns over here. Nothing to worry about. Uh, then I went ahead and made this tunnel another sign coral arch i want a coral arch right over here that would be cool so then i went ahead and make this tunnel too and then you get into this ravine which i really like there's a smaller ravine over here and this big one leads to nothingness still but i've been working on a lot of stuff look at that rex frost has been doing this i think this isn't me that isn't me but it's uh it's coming together. It's coming together. So I just went back home and uh, I got my coral chest. So let's see what we can do over here. Uh, ooh, this is the coral arch. I don't know how I'm gonna do this, but I like the blue. I like the yellow. Maybe a bit of red. 
Uh, don't put that in the chest, please. Just put it over there. And then I was thinking of maybe making arches like this. They don't have to be the same. They don't have to be straight. Uh, I'm going to get that off, get that off, get that off. Yeah, this is annoying. So for some reason, this happens. You would say there is a source block on this side, source block on that side, on this side, on that side. Why would it not fill that in? I've had the same issue with uh, these kind of blocks, with the fences and such. If I place a fence or a wall underwater, it does not get water locked instantly. I have to go up here, steal some water from the surface, surface which it doesn't fill either. <laughs> go over here, fill that in, and then still you have these random spots where you can see the surface. Look at that. This is really annoying to me. And that is even more annoying. Look at that. Oh, I cannot take that. Um, <laughs> anyway, we were working on these arches. Uh, let's make another one possibly over here. Rex Ross is back. Let's make that one a little bit higher. Uh, that one can go. That one can go. No, let's actually make it connect over there. Okay, that's good. That's good. Maybe uh, a standing yellow one over here. Like that. And then maybe you can go this way a little. No, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> and then maybe another one. Just like so. Give me that. Oh, it's gone to waste. Oh, I didn't think about that. That sucks so bad. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is basically the plan. I'm gonna uh, decorate a little bit with the coral fans and such. These things. And then uh, we'll see how it looks. Okay, yeah. That's it. That looks cool. I like that. Oh, I like that. Okay. This can go. Come to me. Uh, you can go. Come to me. Did you come? Yes, you did. Okay. Nice. Nice. So let's see what we can do at this valley over here. I'm thinking maybe not full arches, but, you know, a bit sticking out of the walls so that it is kind of archy, like you can swim underneath it. I'm going to try that. It'll it'll be tough. It'll be tough for sure. Oh, so this is uh, messed up. Every time that I mine, it creates an air hole and then it just destroys the coral why does it do that I, and that doesn't make any sense i made a mistake i want my coral back is it because of my fortune maybe with silk touch oh oopsie <laughs> oh ho, 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 yes there we go look at this peeps oh i like it so much it's so interesting look at that Yes, if we could, if we could get some fishes in here, that would be the best. That would be the best. Unfortunately, though, it does this again. I don't know why. I've seen it multiple places. Uh, not at the moment, though. But <laughs> I've seen it, and it's weird. I don't know why it does that. Ugh. So I was thinking. I have been working with coral and with uh, uh, how do with these things called the conduits a lot lately, and we don't have a shop of that yet. So, what do you guys think? Should we make another uh, another subsidiary of uh, Coffee Sippers Limited? <laughs> I think so. So, the thing I've been thinking about, the thing I've been thinking about, maybe we could make an underwater shop. Like, this is covered by the conduit over there, I believe. There's a conduit, and there's a conduit. But what if we make were to make an underwater shop right here? We make a cave, and then make that our coral and conduit shop? That would be cool, right? I'm going to make a massive coral reef over here anyway, so we could use that to our advantage and make this the prime location of our shop. I'm thinking yes. 
Right, so right now I've dug a hole and uh, it's not too big, but I don't want it too big. Uh, I just need to decorate it a little. I want to, you know, use the resources that I have used for the valley and for these uh, tunnels. I want to include a little bit and the side, a little bit of stair action, slab action, wall action. And then that will be pretty as fudge. And then I'm probably going to include a little bit, maybe of acacia wood. That would be cool, like supports of acacia wood. And then, uh, you know, our coral fan here and there. Because we're going to sell coral, we need to display it, right? All right, all right, all right, peeps. So here we are at our conduit shop. Oh, ho, 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 ho. yes. So we are selling conduit kits for 20 diamonds each. I actually put one in here just for, uh, you know, for looks. <laughs> just so I have something in here. Uh, we're going to sell blocks and fans two for five diamonds each stack. So this one is five diamonds. This one's five diamonds. That is five diamonds. So everything, every stack that you can find in these chests is five diamonds. I actually made another one because I believe I can get another color. I don't know for sure though. There is still room for expansion, but I think there is one other block that I haven't found yet, but uh, I'm gonna need to discover a lot of stuff. I need, I'm gonna need to mine a lot of stuff. I was going to need to mine a lot of stuff anyway, because I'm totally out of gravel, totally out of sand, so I cannot make any more concrete for another tunnel. And now I have to collect all this uh, coral and conduits. So I'm gonna do that uh, off camera. It'll probably take me the rest of the day, but uh, that's fine. That only means that this will be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, then please leave a like and a comment in the section down below. And if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing for more awesomeness. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. Sun, no pain when it's gone, took you to 